Yes. Go and make an announcement. Go and make him announcement. This is my new signing, Alan the Savage Babbage. Be careful, can you turn into a cabbage? Remember, I tell you that first. That means. Yep. Savage Babbage. He's a beast, the Savage Babbage. Remember, be careful, because you turn your leave into a cabbage. He's fighting. Okay. Thursday in Italy. In Italy, yeah. And then he's gonna yeah. fight in the undercard um, on my fight as well. New signing, heavyweight prospect. L top amateur from Croatia. Now he's got fan friendly style, this man. He don't know backward step, he comes forward and he throws. We, uh, we had some great sparring, been good work. She one of our main sparring partner at the camp. I've had a lot of other guys, but you know. This man's a madman. The first day he come, we, we went to the gym to train in the morning. He says, I know train. I know do strength and condition. What's that? Action? I come only to sparring. He says, I fight with everything. He says, <laughs> I fight, I don't run, I nothing. I give 200% in sparring. And he just came for the whole time. He just come forward. See? Ali just going to shoot me like this. that for, for like 20 minutes. <laughs> and then he goes, When I have sparring, I focus only sparring, nothing. I just come there, I give you good work. That's hence the name, the Savage Babbage. You that will see. Okay. Keep an eye out for him. I think he's a top prospect. I think um, he's got a vicious style. You know, um, just come forward, man. He throws like two, three hundred punches around. Fit as well. Why, why are you letting this man guide your career? Because I trust him totally. You know, we, we come out like uh, on the right foot, right again. You know, I think um, we are very similar. You know. I see how much people send him home from training camp. From from Arsenal. Yeah, I was in a few camps before. In two camps. I leave him with you guys. Yeah. Yeah. Many top fighters. I was in two camps before, you know. Yeah. And on the boat camp, they sent me home after the first party. So I go hard on the first party. I never go easy. I never go easy. And then, and they sent me home, you know. So, and I, I I do that the same thing with Dylan. I went full out, and it was a hard party. First party was the hardest. And he was like, give me more. So we went, whoa, it's good. You know? And then we did. Two more rounds and then another round. We did five rounds per day. And after the sparring, he talked to me. He said, I want you to fight for me. And I was like, fuck. How many sparring. rounds have you sparred with Dylan? I did 30 rounds. 30, Three, round. yeah, 30 rounds. We did uh, five, then we did six, I think four, six, two, six, something like that. Okay. I'm always the first party partner, so uh, you, you, you go on the toughest, you know, you, you take the toughest first one. First party part of the top so I'm the first one and it was just been an amazing journey. You know. What um what is your record in the moment? I have ar ar around 80, 90 fights amateur, yeah. around 70 victories, but most of them are KO. You know. And as a pro? As a pro I don't have any fights. So your first fight is on yeah, yeah, yeah. At the on the Matchroom show in Italy? Yeah, Matchroom show. Yeah. yeah, it's your debut, okay. It's my debut, yeah. And then you're going to be on Dylan White's card yeah, the week too. after as yeah, well? Yeah, it will be the first fight. Yeah. I was so happy, you know, I was so grateful. I know I belong there, you know, and I just needed a chance. And Dylan White gave me the chance, and I can never express my happiness. What is your but, background as well? Sorry to cut you. Yeah. What, was your, what is your background? Well, I was... Okay. I was in, I was in MMA. I was champion of my uh, of Croatia in MMA. So I came to the boxing, and it's about, I, I was in sports my whole life, you know. Okay. All right, no problem. Are you going to do a little workout in there? Yeah, I'm going to do All right, yeah. go on. Nice to meet you.